People are awesome. Especially the ones that I meet during my travels. They are new and have no filters. To me, meeting new people is like trying new cuisine. It's a wonderful bonus of traveling this world. I've spent four years on the road and I've stayed with over 400 different families and met so many people for me to even count. This once, while traveling in Mexico, I met Arturo, the archaeological guide who taught me about saying please and thank you and also taught me about being kind and to start off by greeting rather than overpowering that person. And this other time, while I was volunteering in Auroville, in a farm that practices permaculture, we were taught about weeding. That is to remove the unwanted plants so that the main plant can get all the sun, energy and nutrition. And it is also good to grow different veggies or to rotate your produce to keep your land fertile. Such is with this life and people in it. So what I'm saying is, people surround themselves in a bubble of 50 odd people who are from the same place and enter into this comfort zone. But from where I stand, it really isn't a comfort zone. It's more of a congested space that you've limited yourself to. Now, I can't ask you to step out of your comfort zone with new people, because that's your decision. But what I ask you instead is to expand your comfort zone and to let other people in your life. Now, there's an added bonus to this too. You'll be exposed to so much more knowledge. These new people will share their stories that will expose you to new cultures, new beliefs, new ideas. And that might just change your life. Hola, yo me llamo Paco, es Soy de la India. See you next week for another story. And please do share in the comments the awesome people you have met while traveling. Ciao.